Hey everyone. Today I'm going to take a look at uh, Papers, Please. It's a game by an indie developer, Lucas Pope. Um, right now the game is still in beta, so you can go check it out. It doesn't have the full uh, game in it, but but I just want to hop in and kind of show you what Papers, Please looks like. Um, I already love the music right off the bat. If you have seen this at all, this is something... Uh, it feels very Slavic Russia, kind of drudgy, but we'll continue into my game. Um, I'm going to try to explain this best I can. It's a little tough with what you have to do with all the fact checking I have to do at, the, at this point. You know, let's walk to work. So basically, you are the guy sitting in the booth allowing all these people to get into your country. Okay, Inspector, from today, foreigners with a valid passport are permitted to enter. Your booth's inspection hardware is now installed. Check all passport information carefully for discrepancies. Deny any entrant with inconsistent information. So, so it's just teaching uh, you how to inspect. So enter inspect mode using the red button on your desk. You know, and then highlight the two pieces of discrepant information from inspect mode to enable interrogation. That sort of thing. So we'll go ahead and drop that in our folder here. It's all about just calling up the next person in line. So you bring up their papers. Now, what are the rules? Enter must have a passport. All documents must be current. Okay. So she's female, Boston, expires um, the 84th with nine. She looks okay. See how it goes. Now, now I can call the next person. That's all there is to it. Unfortunately, this game will throw you curveballs at times. And the goal of this is to try to make money to you know, get get money for your son and to pay rent, and you'll see that at the end of a level as well. Date of birth is the is 5:25. Let's see, expires the 26th. It looks like he's okay. So it takes a little bit of time to get into this as well, and it, and then you can also check like the area he's from, which is Integra. So. So outer gross, that's there. So we could uh, approve him. Fortunately, I'm running out of time very quickly on this just because I'm taking the time. So I obviously just messed up my invalid expiration date. So this this date sort of confuses me just because it's not in the time that I'm used to. So we'll throw that on the desk. Um, let's see, Integra, yeah, expires. 14th, 83. He's okay. Kind of looks like the guy he was. Yeah, so. I got another one. I wasn't paying attention. So this time, didn't pay attention to the city. So these are going to hurt my overall income for the day. Strutska. East Greston. Um... East Greston. Let's see. Expires the 83rd of... So this guy's expired. So we're going to decline him. And I could say... That. And that. And then... Okay, well... I'm, I guess I don't know. I, I just, this thing still confuses me. Still confuses me a bit. Is it's November twenty fourth, eighty two, and I, I I sent him away. This takes a little bit of getting used to, like I said, but you know, better at this. So I'll pop him open here. He expires the eighty fourth. Uh, let's see, nine ten, East Creston, male. Looks all right. So, it's a very visual game. You, you really have to pick up those details. It's it's really tough to 
um, you know, concentrate and make sure you're doing everything right. Spire's 83rd. She's okay. She dropped something on my desk. Alrighty. Just throw that over there with my three discrepancies and we can call another person. The time is running out for the day and you'll see in a minute what that means. She'll drop her papers here. She's from... United Federation. So she's from there. 83. Ah, but it says she's male. So I can interrogate her. I'm going to decline her. Most of the time, I won't even ask their interrogations because it's about getting people to, to get through the line. That's how I make my money. So, I don't have time to really talk to people. That doesn't look like her. I'm just going to throw her. Oh, and someone's running the line. So. And that's that just happened. That was something that just happened. So. Um, let's see. Okay, so as you can see, during at the end of the day, here are your, your family members, your mother-in-law, your uncle, your wife, your son. And then you have this money right here that shows penalties. Of course, I, I made a penalty, you know, a negative for rent, negative for food, negative for heat, and this is how much I made. So overall, I have $15 left. But I don't have enough money for food this week, so I'll choose heat. And we'll sleep. I'm down five dollars because of that penalty. If I would have made that penal, if I wouldn't have made that penalty, I would have had enough money to, you know, actually let my people, my family eat. So, terror strike at Greston. Hop down here again. Walk into work. You know, as you can see now, they've bumped up security a little bit. So we've got new parameters for the day. Entry for non-citizens is now regulated. All foreigners require a valid entry ticket, verify information before stamping passports, entry visa, and returning to documents to entrant. Glory to Ostrotska. Same stuff as always. I'll lift up the curtain here. Call someone in. Later in stages, it gets much more intense. I mean, they have to have all kinds of different documentation. So you're making sure that that's, that's valid November 25th. And then expires 84, so they're fine. That guy looks like that guy. Um, now, the only thing I, I try to check on all the time, and this this is what takes me all, a ton of time, is true, which he's fine, so we'll let him go. And you got to give him his entry ticket back. So I, I'm going to keep this open. This is just easy for me to check those 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 cities um, it's just cool the interactions you have with people some people it's, it's just interesting all the differences you can come across so female she's fine 83 West Greston where did it say she was from Kalechia uh, West Greston she looks alright oh but she doesn't have an entry ticket so I'm going to deny her move on to the next person it's all about how fast you can get through it and it would be cool to do the interrogation but I run into the problem where I have to you know I have to get these people going I have to get them out of here so impor okay and they tell you what their what their passport will look like so 82 11 25 84 this person's fine I'll let them go get in their ticket so, another one of these. Fantastic. Throw that over there. This game is, um... I know it's not the funnest 
to watch, but I think it, it you you get the real challenge when you're sitting here, you know, checking all this information for yourself. It gets really. T- I is that a man or a woman? I that's matching. That's I, I don't know what that is. So prove this person. I'm not gonna, you know, sometimes for the sake of time, I'm not gonna check everything, and that's where I think I will get the most trouble. Obviously, I'm okay there. I'm not getting any, you know, ticket for doing something wrong, but. Papers, please. And they'll talk to you, but I don't have time to pay attention to that either, so. You, know, you really fit into this, this role of, I don't have time, stop talking to me, give me your stuff. Papers, please, get out. Okay, Orbiston. Murgus. So I've had people with the weird cities. So 83, it expires. Not too bad this time. Like I said, it takes a little bit of adjusting to get used to. 82. That date is wrong. So, I can't just give him back his things. I have to deny him. So, we're getting around that time where the day's almost done, but let's see what we can do here. 82, 1125, 84, it's a male. United, let's see, United Federation, Krista City. So, we can approve this person. couple more. It looks like the day's about to end, so I have to hurry with this person. But <laughs> they have no papers. I had, uh, okay. So I have to point out that this person has no papers. I don't know how to tell this person. Not sure how to tell this person no. <laughs> this is interesting. Um, where's your Where's your passport? All right, there we go. That can get you. Uh, that can get you in a little bit of trouble. Is not knowing where to click to call out those discrepancies. That's I think that's the biggest problem with it. I'm probably not going to get to another person, and most likely is going to close me off here from this one. So, 83, 82, 11, 25, male. So, looks like we still have some time, but at any minute they could close me down. 2583 male outer gross integria that's it for the day so as you can see nothing happened that day you know I, I get to pay for everything it 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 gives it gives me everything because I have the money it only lets you make that choice if um, you only can choose one or the other. So as you can see, my son is sick. So, but I'm able to pay for medicine, so hopefully he'll be okay. So that, that and all is papers, please. It, as you get farther into the experience, you, you get thrown more things. There's more, I can show you the next one. We'll probably have more things now to like, that are required. But that's Papers, Please. You can download that for free. Just go ahead and search that up. That's on his own personal website. Um, you know, you you can go and download it. Right now, it's still in beta. Um, I know there's a, if you do pay a fee, you can even get your own personality in the game as one of the people that approaches the gate. 
Um, but thanks for watching, guys, and I'll, I'll catch you later.